Hello, welcome back. I'm Victoria from Mom Crafting, a blog where I uh, keep track of the different creative pursuits that I enjoy. Sewing is one of my favorite hobbies and recently I purchased some fabric from Fabric Mart, one of my favorite stores for purchasing fabric. They have a wonderful surprise pack. They call it their um, bundles where you get fabric at a discount price, but you don't know exactly what you're going to get. So I ordered, when I ordered um, a bunch of fabric, which you can, if you're curious what I got, you can see that on a previous video. Uh, but what, when I ordered that, I also added the 10 yard bundle and uh, it's, it's always fun to see what you get. This is the third or fourth bundle I've gotten and each time I've been um, pleasantly surprised. Usually there's some pieces where I wouldn't have chosen them, but I really like them. And so this time there were, it, it was kind of like that. And it, I like it too because it stretches me. It makes me um, have to think about how to use fabrics that, um, that yes, I wouldn't, wouldn't have chosen and they're a little bit outside of my comfort zone. So what do I do with them and how do I utilize them in a way where I will use them or do I know someone that I can make something for who will enjoy them? So, I know you're waiting to see what I got. Uh, let me show you the first piece. So I got two and three quarters yards of this beautiful blue, I believe it's a cotton, it's an embroidered um, woven. I love the blue, it's such a, such a deep dark blue, one of my favorite shades. But it has these beautiful um, floral embroidery and it's it's an eyelet so in some of them it actually has the uh, the fabric has been cut away inside the embroidery um, as you get closer to the hem and then the hem is its own special surprise because the whole hem is this beautiful lace work along there so this will be a lot of fun to design I right now my thoughts are making um, an A-line or sheath dress with princess seams. Um, don't know exactly what it will look like yet, but um, the the gears are already churning, and I'm excited for what this will turn turn into. Especially with the lace, I'll use that, keep that at the hemline, and so that will be a fun one to sew with. And then I got almost two yards of this fun print, which is. This is bright, bright green, almost chartreuse, along with a teal and black and blue, um, and it's it's just a lot of fun. It's a very, very drapey knit. Um, it doesn't have a whole lot of stretch to it. It's probably like 10%, maybe 20%. But um, this most likely I'm going to make or use it in some sundresses for my girls. I think they will have lots of fun with the bright print. I don't tend to wear bright um, colors as much. So I don't know that I'll make something for me out of this. It doesn't it doesn't strike me as something that I really want to wear. Um, but I think my girls will enjoy enjoy that. And then this one is the one that has me kind of scratching my head and wondering what am I going to do with it. It's a woven. There's four yards of it. So I have plenty of fabric to think of something to do with it. Um, it does have some stretch uh, one way and then um, it's kind of a nice taupe color. I think it's probably a like rayon mix. It kind of has that, it, I just, it feels soft, it's a little bit crisp. As you can tell it holds a wrinkle. <laughs> so it's, mm, some of my thoughts are making pants or um, skirt out of it and uh, I think probably I'll make make one of those and then decide what I want to do with the rest of it, it since I since I have such a large amount of it um, but it has a nice feel I like the feel the texture on it is almost a linen look it it's a little bit of a rough um, rough wo woven it's not completely smooth and so when you look at it closely it has a really neat um, just feel to it. It's, it has a little more 
grip than um, a smooth woven would be. So I, I like that. And then <laughs> the last one um, is probably the one most outside my comfort zone where it's just a little bit not what I what is up down my normal alley. But it is um, some jute burlap. And so this is, I am not a um, uh, shabby chic or country house um, decorator, so it's, I've never used burlap before. I do like that this is green. I think that makes it much easier for me to use than if it were your standard brown burlap. Um, but there's two yards of that, and honestly, I'm thinking I'm going to use it to make bags. So that's something that I um, can see myself making and either using them as gifts or if I really like them, using them myself. So that is what I received in my bundle pack and I'm really excited about seeing what all that fabric turns into.